everybody, it's the English Simmer here, and welcome back to the Younguns. So, this part is gonna be about what you guys want to see from this Let's Play. So, they'll, oh well, I'll try and put a poll card at the end if I can figure out how to do that on YouTube, um, because I want your guys' decision. I want you guys to get involved. I want to do what you want to see and all of that good stuff. So basically, I am starting to record this. It's such an awkward position. I don't really know why I chose to start recording at 2 p.m. in sim time, but I did because that's just me and I'm quirky like that. Ding! Um, but yeah, I am back and Nina is pretty much just working on her wellness skill. She's actually a level 9 in the wellness skill, which is insane and we are definitely going to start exploring this more. I'm pretty much thinking that Nina is kind of going to start her own home business. So um, it's not going to be anything fancy. We aren't going to own another shop. Although we could probably do that, if I'm honest. Oh, and Haley just got promoted to Illustrious Illustrator. Haley has been promoted. She will now make an additional 140 simoleons per hour for a grand total of 280 per hour. She's also received a 1,600 bonus and a premium prima ballerina well that's hard to say but cool she's been promoted and she only works like three days a week which is sick and nathan got back from school and his work is satisfactory what are you doing buddy you need to get up your your uh, grades but um he is doing well in work, to be fair. He's a, a retail employee, so uh, he's pretty good. He actually has work today. Damn it, Nathan. I wanted you to do something. I guess we could take the day off, because um, I did want to do something. We're going to take a vacation day from retail, because I'm fairly sure. Yeah, he has three days for vacation days so we're gonna take one off but like I said Nina's working on her meditation and I'm thinking she's gonna start her own home business in which we'll invite around our friends and to be honest it's probably well it's definitely not gonna earn us any money I don't think but it could because we could like offer a massage and yeah because she's really good at wellness I want to try and explore the wellness skill in this let's play because I haven't really done that and um I'm excited to see what like massages she's unlocked and everything like that so we will be doing that. What level are you on Haley? Level 9! What? So she needs to reach logic skill level 6 which we can definitely do. Um, do we have a logic book? How did we get her logic skill up before? I don't really know. Um, has she finished this one? Yes, she has. Okay, so loads of you were saying that she wanted Haley to actually have the soulmate thing, which is have a boyfriend or girlfriend, go on two dates, become an adult, be married to BFF, um, and two dates with spouse. And yeah, so I think we could definitely do this for her. So we are gonna do that. And she already has a girlfriend, obviously, so she just needs to go on two dates. Um, but do we have a logic book? I'm fairly sure we probably do. Where's our bookcase? Ugh. Where's the, do we even have a bookcase? Uh, yeah, she has some bookcases. Um, Let's see if we have a logic, uh, we have a logic level one. Okay, well, we're gonna need, we're gonna need something a little bit more than that. So let's get on this. We are gonna go for a logic. Why do I sound so hyper in this video? All right, we're gonna go for that. And hopefully that will be in your inventory, which it is. So you're gonna read logic level two. I'm gonna have her do a little bit of that. Um, and then with Nathan, don't eat the freaking cake. Oh, seriously. Nathan, get out of there. You little silly nugget. Why have they all started eating the cake? Hey Nathan, it's Marisol. Do you want to hang out tonight at the nightclub? You know what Marisol? I was going to say no because I was actually going to go around to Sophia's house. Basically, the story is that Sophia, who is a new teenage sim in Get Together, she's part of the Paragon. She's really, really cute. 
Um, but yeah, she was going to invite us around to her house. But if we already know her, then we can accept and select her to travel with. I'm hoping that we know her. If we don't, then we'll go to the discotheque for a bit and then get a little bit tipsy and just turn up at Sophia's house and be like, hey. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's basically what I wanted to do with Nathan in this part. So it's quite nice that Marisol's asked us to hang out, actually. So what we are going to do is click accept um, and Sims to travel with. Okay, so we don't know her, but we are going to invite Kai and Paxton. I have not changed Kai's look, which I will probably actually do in this part because why is he wearing shades? What is going on here? Um, we aren't going to actually invite Luna. Well, we can, I guess. But basically, I was going to get Nathan into a romantic relationship with Luna but then I kind of did that in my Black Widow challenge so I kind of don't want two of my sims to be dating the same sim even if it isn't a different completely different save file um because that's just a little bit messy so we're actually gonna go for Sophia instead and I kind of want them to to have a really cutesy like teen romance which will be adorable I think so hopefully we'll be able to go around to her house later and she will actually be there because I swear it's like the most annoying thing when you want to go to a sims house and they just aren't there but hopefully it'll be a little bit later so, um, we're partying with club friends. <laughs> Obviously, oh, Ted's here. Um, hey, Ted. Um, oh, and our granddad, which is really, really awkward. Um, why are you doing sit-ups? Seriously? You're just gonna, you're just gonna start doing sit-ups. We're gonna order some food first, because he's pretty hungry. So, um, we're gonna order, uh, a pretzel. So go grab a pretzel, Nathan, and uh, yeah, we're just going to hang with our club friends for a little bit, um, get some dancing on, try and get our dancing skill up. Oh, Kai, I seriously need to change your outfit right now. I'm going to quickly do this off screen, guys, so I will be back with you guys in a second. Okay guys, so I am back and this is the new and improved Kai Snow. He actually looks a little bit more like the snows than um, Paxton does. He has like quite a small jaw and also the cheekbones of Harvey because the snows have cheekbones for days basically. But yeah, I kind of went for a longer shaggier look with him. You know, Paxton's very like clean cut. Um, and with him, I kind of went for something a little bit crazy. Well, not crazy, but um, he's definitely different from his brother, which is really cute, actually. He looks like he's completely his own person, which is awesome. Uh, why are we all saying goodbye? Let's just start a gathering. Let's just stay here. Like, because then I know that they aren't going to leave. So, um, actually, they all still look like they're leaving. Oh, wow, we have a ghost, you know, jamming at the disco. Why is everyone leaving? I wanted, like, a really cute, like, hangout, but clearly not. Why aren't the boys part of the gathering? Uh, part of the club. Paxton, I swear you were part of the club. Um, right, let's add him. So Kai's in, and then where's Paxton? Where are you, my friend? Friend? Friend, where are you? Oh, he's he's pretty cool looking. Uh, where is Paxton? Paxton is not on here. So Sophia we can actually add in. Uh, is Paxton still a teen? <laughs> I'm fairly sure he should still be a teen. I thought he was part of the club. I have no idea why Paxton's not part of the club. So Kai's stayed, um, but Marisol's gone home, even though she was the one who freaking invited us. Um, so yeah, that's cool. But we're going to um, just eat this pretzel, and then I think we're going to have a couple of drinks. I thought Sophia would um, actually, maybe she'd arrive, but she hasn't. I don't know why I can't add um, thingy into this group. Right, where is Paxton? We're gonna send him a text. I just don't understand why he's not available to add to the club. He's a teen and apparently we can't do it, which is cool. Oh no, this is awkward. <laughs> Paxton's mum's here, bless him. Bless him. 
Oh. 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 He's like, hey. <laughs> That's cute. Look, these two are actually getting along together. I think we should do a uh, a club dance. I don't know why she isn't here. But uh, let's try this. We're going to do a group dance. We're going to try one, two stepping. But first we need to finish this pretzel off. And I also want to grab a drink. Screw it. We're not going to send a uh, text to Paxton. Oh, we can't, we can't dance because Paolo is hogging the dance floor. Right, let's order our favorite drink. Let's see what Nathan's favorite drink is. I actually love this interaction just because I like the fact that my Sims have favorite drinks. Even though sometimes they're like non-alcoholic, which I'm like, what's the point, really? Oh my god, we're up like raving on a Tuesday night in the club on a Tuesday on a school night. Disgraceful. Um... None of the spin masters are down here. I don't know why. I would use that room. Um, but none of them seem to. Like, even... Oh, okay. That's cool, you know. That's that's solid. Right, we're gonna make a drink. We're gonna make a drink for myself. And we are gonna make a juice on the rocks. Go for it, Nathan. Because the mixologist walked up, just walked out on us. Like, what the hell? Why did she just walk out on us? I have no idea. But we're going to make our own drink because we can. So uh, let's do that. It's going to be terrible though because um, he does not have the mixology skill. So it's probably going to be really, really bad. Oh, okay. She's back. The mixo a mixologist is back, but we are still making a drink. And she's currently stood inside us. Um, drink that drink. You also need to use the toilet. Where are the toilets in here? Are there any upstairs or do we have to? There are some upstairs. So we're going to go use the toilet. And although we aren't going to be tipsy because we've literally had one drink and we haven't even finished that yet, I feel like we should go over to Sophia's um, kind of like at an appropriate-ish time. Like... I don't want to just like turn up at like 10 p.m. Um, so I'm feeling like 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock is an okay time. And even though I don't think they know each other, we're going to pretend that they met each other in school. And I really dislike this new culling relationships thing. I need to download the mod that um, stops that because it's really annoying that all of my relationships are just fading away so quickly it's really really irritating so i'm gonna download that mod probably after this part so that the relationship calling will end but we are gonna travel uh i should have probably ended the gathering because i don't want them to come with me that's luna's house this is sophia's house and we're gonna travel here but we're gonna travel here alone um so no one please come with because, you know, don't want the whole crew turning up with us. That'd be awkward. She's like, hey, Sophia, uh, you know, I kind of like you, but, you know, I, I just brought the gang with me to hang out. Even though her and Luna, I think, are really good friends because they are both in the Paragons. So she probably wouldn't be too annoyed if we bring Brang, 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 Brung, if we brought... That was the word I was looking for. If we brought Luna, but I kind of don't want to do that. Just because I want it to be a little bit intimate, at least. She is here, so that's good. Uh, we're going to go give her a cheerful intro. We're going to try and um, introduce ourselves in a good way. She's watching comedy, which is good, considering he wants to be a comedian. No, actually, I want him to be a secret agent, don't I? Have three friends introduce yourselves to how many Sims? Ten. You've introduced yourself to two, three. We're going to have a gossip. We're going to tell her a funny story and we're going to ask her about her day. See, she's adorable. She's like a Barbie doll. She's just got this really like cutesy baby face. I really like Sophia. I think she's so cute. We should probably go introduce ourselves um, to her family too because that'll be like three more people that we can introduce ourselves to, which is always good. Her little sister's out here playing. We're going to give her mum a cheerful intro and we're going to give little Elsa a cheerful intro too. Um, 
So go introduce yourselves to the fam. Moving fast. <laughs> Nathan just wants to get on the good side of everyone. Um, so we reach charisma level five. Nathan can now start a social network on a computer. He can also practice storytelling in a mirror and perform a flirty intro. We are actually going to start a social media page. Do you have a computer? You probably do because this house is intense. But you don't have a fish, so I am going to buy you a guppy because I'm sure Elsa will like that. We're going to come here and we are going to socialize. We are going to... Um, actually, how do we start social media? Charisma. Start social network. Let's do it. Sophia, don't use that computer. Biatch, I am watching... Serious? Are you for real right now? <laughs> the one time we want to use a computer and somebody's on it. Yes, Sophia, I'm looking at you when I say that's somebody. That's actually so annoying. <laughs> Why are you using it? Can we even kick people off? I hope we can't. No, we can't. Well, he's not going to try anyway. Oh, yeah, he is. There we go. She's off. Can you all stop like going for the computer? Okay, they're not. They're talking to each other. Aww. Cute mother and uh, daughter moment right there. Uh, there we go. I think we set that up. Um, so let's charisma. We're going to update social network. Um, just this one time. And then we're going to check our followers. Because thirsty. Um, right. Oh, look. She's so, she's so sweet. Um, let's check our total followers after we have updated dated it um and then we're gonna like why is this family like so affectionate they are like all over each other right we're just gonna talk to her as we're doing this we're gonna enthuse about her interests and we're gonna um brighten her day a little bit uh flatter her do we not get notifications for our um for our social network like is it not like Sims 3 social networks where it tells you, it doesn't tell you the updates? I don't know, but we're just going to have a chat with Sophia because that's what we came here about. Um, we're going to complain about parents, even though Chloe and Jared are pretty safe parents. But, you know, I don't think Nathan really approves of Jared's new girlfriend. You know, he walked out on her when she was, like, introducing herself to him. Uh, but it's, like, 10 p.m. and he's, he really, oh, this is their bedroom. Don't get into bed with your dad. No. What? Why? 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 Shouldn't your mum be sleeping there? Your mum's sleeping on a bench. Sophia, what are you doing? You have a bedroom down here. What the heck? Where's Elsa? How is Elsa not asleep right now? She's still playing. Girl, what are you doing? It's like 11pm at night. You should definitely be asleep. And why is she sleeping in her dad's room? I don't understand. I don't get it, guys. Right, we're going to watch a channel. We're going to watch the comedy channel. Just because I do kind of want to get his fun up. What's he currently? He's trolling the forums. You know, that's going to get his fun up. Um, We could also um check total followers i want to see how many followers we have does it give us an update i really don't know i don't really he has 14 followers sick update it again let's do it hopefully we don't lose any because i want to get a big following right now check your followers again we're so thirsty <laughs> the thirst is real right now guys we are like a social media he's like the next uh I'm trying to think of a big social media person like Dallas Cameron. Is his name Cameron Dallas? Cameron Dallas. That's the one. 19 followers. We're getting there, dude. You are getting there. You know, you got to up your Instagram game and all of that fun stuff. You got to start taking some selfies. Start making like those 10 second Vine videos. I don't even know. Six seconds? I don't know. I don't watch Vines. I watch them like a little bit. Like if someone sends me a funny one, I'll watch it. But I don't go out of my way to like watch them, I guess. But oh well. Uh, why are you playing chess? You just randomly decided to do that? That's all cool, I guess. And you're going to go tell a gross joke to Clara. I'm sure Clara is going to love that. <laughs> Seriously, what is happening in this family? I don't understand why she's sleeping with her dad. 
Like, I really, really don't understand it. They both just woke up because of the TV. They were like, this is too loud. Oh, apparently she didn't like the gross joke. <laughs> That's funny. Are you telling us goodbye? Are you saying that we should leave? She just like waved bye bye to us. So I'm guessing that that's a hint that we should probably leave. And oh, she just hooked us. I almost missed that because I was looking down at my keyboard. But she just hooked us, which is cute. Why did I click Windenburg? I do not want to travel back here. I want to travel to Newcrest, back to our house, because I actually want my Sims to get some sleep tonight. So uh, let's travel back here and we're just going to send everyone to sleep. Maybe if Nina's feeling it, um, if she's not too tired, we'll do a little bit more meditation with her. But yeah, I think within the next um, part, we'll start up that little massage parlor for her. I think that could be really fun actually i'm really looking forward to doing that because i feel like nina she doesn't have a job so she doesn't really have much to focus on like she obviously has her garden which by the way we now have five out of ten excellent plants so we're definitely getting there with the excellent plants even though it takes forever basically all you have to do is keep on fertilizing them and keep on evolving them which i have been doing but right let's send everyone to bed um we need to do this so nathan your bed is downstairs what am i doing uh you can go to sleep and chloe you're actually feeling wide awake right now but you're gonna go sleep and nina is feeling pretty energized you can go sleep though even though they're all feeling really really um pumped up but nina why don't you come work on your wellness skill again do we even have a dartboard i think i might have added one actually um i think it might be down in nathan's room though I feel like Nathan has all the fun stuff. Oh, we didn't do our homework. Oh, well, he's still a C student, as you do. <laughs> Is he going to sleep? Oh, he's like super tired. He's just traipsing along. Chloe's in bed. Um, Haley's just about to get into bed. And Nina's back to her wellness skill. I really just want her to, um, to get this up. And we also need to prune her uh, thing, actually. So here she goes, she's on a roll with the wellness skill, but it's probably going to take a while to get this up to a level 10 because she seems to be stuck on like 50%. Like it takes, it's taken a while to get up there, but let's go on here quickly. Uh, let's see how fast it's going up. 55% complete and it's really not going up all that quickly. Well, it kind of is, but not really. Like it takes like half an hour for 1%, so... I think it's it's probably going to take a while, guys. But I am going to end this part here. But before I do, I want to get you guys involved, like I said. So at the end of this video, hopefully, if I can figure it out, there will be a poll card, if I can figure it out and know how to do it on YouTube. But basically, this poll is whether or not you want Haley to move out. So basically, I want the youngins to start settling down and getting into more serious relationships and things like that. Haley is already in a relationship with Lacey. They've been dating for probably like months or years now in Sims. Um, but they've been dating for a fair while and they're very serious. They're girlfriends. They stay over at each other's houses. So do you want me to move Haley out with Lacey or do you want me to move Lacey in with Haley? So she can either move out or stay here but basically if we move Lacey in then we're gonna have quite a few sims because I am planning on Chloe on settling down with someone too so um we might have a lot of sims which might take away my attention so it's completely up to you guys but just keep that in mind and also I want you guys to get involved and create a boyfriend for little Miss Chloe so basically probably for the last 30 parts we've been to and fro between ted and harry and it's pretty much 50 50 some of you say harry is too young for her and you don't like him whereas others love him some of you say ted is perfect for her and she deserves him others say you just hate ted so i kind of don't want her to be with either of them at this point she can be friends with them she can be close to them but 
I kind of wanted to introduce someone new for Chloe, which is where you guys get involved. And I want you guys to create a potential lover for Chloe. Maybe she'll even date a few of them, but I want her to get out there, meet some new fellas, and just put herself out there because I feel like Chloe would really want to find the one. She's that type of girl. So the hashtag I want you guys to use for this is Youngins BF. So that's all in lowercase. I will leave it in the description. I will also put it up on the screen at this moment in time so that you can see which hashtag I want you to use in the gallery. If you just use that on your Sims description with the hashtag, then it will show up when I search for that hashtag. You can use custom content, but it might get deleted because I might not have it. Um, I will use the CC filter so your sim will show up if it does have custom content on it. I know that I'm talking a lot but that's the hashtag that I want you to use. Youngins BF. Like I said it will be up on the screen and you guys can use it to create a potential lover for little Miss Chloe. So thank you guys so much for watching this part. I hope a couple of you get involved and enjoy making a potential lover for Chloe. Um, yeah, I really hope you guys do get involved because it would mean a lot to me and I love it when I can play with some of your sims and you guys get to see them in my let's plays. So thank you guys so much for watching and for listening to this half an hour discussion. If you like this video, please do give it a big thumbs up and do leave all of your comments and suggestions down below and I will speak to you all in the next part. Bye guys!